of CC Gospel, and I'm the co-host of CC Gospel, Brenda Burns. All right. And our program today, the theme is Old Time Gospel. And right. do you know who the MC for the day is? No, I don't have a clue. You don't have a clue? I sure do. Who is it? It's our own pastor. <laughs> the Elder Robert Oh, my goodness. And he's a man of God, and any time that you go to him and ask him something, he's not going to give you his opinion. He's going to come from the book. And we are really blessed here to have him, and we love him. To some, I'm going to introduce, and to others, I'm going to present our very own Elder Robert House Sr. Amen. <laughs> I don't know how you feel about things in the church, but I am one pastor that uh, stayed busy enough that I didn't necessarily have to be the MC this evening. Uh, I sometimes love to be able to just witness and also to support others. Uh, I'm up speaking uh, more than sometimes I desire to speak, so. Uh, I just want you to know because sometimes you do have pastors that love the limelight. Uh, they love to be up doing something all the time. But 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 sometimes you can be too busy. And you, when you need to be focused and letting God use you and speak through you. Amen. 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 But I thank Amen. the Lord for CC Gospel choosing to uh, allow me this moment. Uh, by all means, I am honored. Amen. Amen. So at this point in time, the program does call for a selection coming from First Street's Mail Coas. At this time, First Street's Mail Coas, would you come? Sometimes I wonder Oh, that's all right. One more time for Jesus. Oh, 
Charles Cole, beautiful man. Thank you for asking me to do this. To y'all beautiful young people, keep on doing what you're doing. I thought it was beautiful. of our 
body? Are we living to? Serve in prison? Are we living for our, our parents to have to visit the cemetery? Are you trying to keep up with somebody? Or what do you really look for in this life? Why would you want to pattern after somebody else that you have seen their life have been destroyed? Why would you want, Lord have mercy, to be of the world and not of Christ? Is that right? Oh, I'm not joking. It's real stuff. Can you imagine how our children are being real? Everybody is working. And somebody else raising your children. You don't know what your children are being taught. Then you wind up wondering why that they're in prison. You're wondering why so much evil is taking place in, in us. Y'all yes, right. listen to me. <laughs> Lord have mercy. So I sit down and I begin to observe what the Bible is teaching. Solomon said that a man that lived this life outside of God that he lived a life in vain. Is that right? That's all right. Young people, are you living in vain? Is this what you want out of life? Are you impressed by some word of deed or word of doing that somebody else is doing? Have you ever noticed what has happened? There are the fires that most young folks die before they're 35. <laughs> and more die before they're 35 than they even have. Right. They're 35. Yes, because they never get 35. Yes, sir. What is it that this is the type of life that we choose? Why is it that we prefer to go to church, be at church, then when we get home, now we want to go and do what the world is doing. We want to reject Jesus. Yeah. Is that right? Yeah. Or else we want to do some of these things in the world and bring them in in the church. Even the pastors are going off. Yeah. They are around stuff to come out of the world. Yeah, into the church. Yeah. And I ought to get the young folk in the church. Yeah. And then you got to keep doing this stuff and all the people. Yeah. 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 Yes, sir. Is that so? Yeah. Yeah. Lord have mercy. Yeah. So it brings the question. Oh, what is the real purpose <laughs> of our living? And this is for everybody. Mm -hmm. Amen. And other for the young folk. Are you looking at where you're going to? Yes. Are you looking at how many young folks died? Look at this. Look how many young folks that have gone off the scene in the last 10 years. Uh, some 